It's a fancy quote that says that self-portraits are a way of revealing something about oneself. I'm not sure what these pictures are revealing to you, but I really like the results of the self-portrait session that I did recently. I'm going to take you through the camera settings that I used, how I set up, and also show you the results that I got from the shoots. In this session, I work with flowers, slightly different from when I worked with mirrors in my last session. So let's get into the, let's get into the video. I'm Yemi. Welcome to my channel. So for my gear, I'm using the M50 and the Nifty 50 Prime Lens. I'm using one flash. I have that small modifier. It's going to be bouncing off the wall so i'm not using like a big modifier this time just that tiny modifier that's on the flash obviously the flash is connected to a trigger i mean to a trans a trigger i have a transmitter on my camera and i am using the canon connect app to control the camera and take the shots i have my reflector i tried to hold my reflector for a good part of the shoot but when i started posing with my hands it became uncomfortable or almost impossible so let's get into it anyways I started off by doing simple poses I had these flowers that I arranged on my head they're like plastic flowers that I got from the dollar store I attached this old white bed spread to my body just giving it some I don't know <laughs> funny old kind of look but the uh, plan was to take like bust pictures eventually so this is the result of like one of the first few pictures that I was okay with I used ISO 400 and I shot around f4 that's my aperture my shutter speed was at 125 throughout the shoot I think I should have increased that in hindsight but I did not so this is what I did I started posing one thing about posing is that if you're not looking funny, awkward yet, you probably have not started the posing. <laughs> For some reason, that's what I figured out. This is the edited version. By the way, all my pictures are edited in Affinity Photo if you are curious about my editing. I have some videos on editing already. So I moved the camera closer to get like closer shots so it's more bust kind of shoots or bust kind of shots now. These are the results. So these camera settings are by the side there. My flash is around 132 and 164 for the entire shoot. So I kept switching back and forth. This is another one. And this is my edited result. So I tend to shoot darker and then increase my lighting in post for the most part. This is another one. I shot at ISO 200 for that one. For some reason I turned down my ISO. I think I probably did that in error. Perhaps I was trying to click for the shoot. I must have, I must have adjusted the eyes. So it happens that way sometimes when you're not really looking at what you're doing on the Canon Connect app. So I decided to take some shoots from the front. I wasn't really a fan of the results, but they were okay. They're like decent. And then, yeah, this is like one of the shots that I picked out. ISO was three, 320 and flash was at. 164 so I shot a bit darker than the previous pictures that I've taken and I mean they're okay but I think I just wanted a little more light okay perhaps my next shoot I will have the light perhaps concentrated a little more as opposed to just using a small modifier and you know letting it bounce off the wall but that will be when I'm ready for my next shoot I don't know when because doing this is taxing like <laughs> i think sometimes i underestimate how much work goes into it but yeah i do still enjoy the results at the end of the day so i started playing with my hands for this one playing playing with the flowers and and my neck and whatnot this is one of the pictures that i got i did not edit this one i might like it like next month or next year and then i'll do the edits i don't know yet I think I liked one of the sh uh, pictures that I did for this one. I didn't bother editing it, but I just liked the actual picture. So, If you want to see an edit, you can let me know in the comments and I'll definitely do an edit. 
but this is one of them and this is the other one i liked the first one more i still went on to try the other side i don't know if you have like a good side and better side that's how i feel sometimes i have a good side and a better side and i just switch back and forth <laughs> this one's also okay so i decided to try playing with my hands the other way like putting it on my head and whatnot this particular pose look at how uncomfortable it is but i really like the shots that i got you're going to see it in the next few seconds this one was okay i was like okay that's fine this one was also good enough like okay that's fly that's okay but this one i really liked and i went on to edit it and here's my edit so i went on to do other poses i think for this particular one the flash was off so i was just clicking clicking away without the flash so it was just light in the room and this is the result that i got it's what i imagined in my head was different but i mean i guess this was the closest i could get to what i was trying to get so it's okay the flowers were i don't know falling off i had to adjust them and try shooting again i think i like my camera messed up too i got that error that i can't i couldn't even read it before it went off anyway i just put my cameras my sd card back in can you imagine how i took this shot do you have an idea of how i posed this is how i posed for it <laughs> it looks like it was taking like top downs kind of thing but i bent my body a little bit so that the camera could be higher and then it would look like it was taking from the top sort of so that's how i got this and this is the edited version and here is another version of the same pose i changed my background to green for this one because i wanted to see what result i would get playing with more colors more than you know two colors basically i can't say that i'm a fan of most of the results that i got but there's one particular one that really caught my attention that i really liked this one was also okay i think my editing had a little too much red in a little too much red in it but that's okay this particular one was my favorite shot so the shot that i got from posing this way this time i was using my leg to control the app yes I had both hands on my head so that was like the option that i had so this is the shot that i got and this is the result what do you guys think i think like this is like the best of all the shots that i took in this shoot but i don't know you can let me know what you think in the comment section i decided to play with this yellow flowers i wasn't getting the result that i wanted i did my best <laughs> I was already tired, so I think that my brain wasn't working the way I expected. But I mean, I might like these pictures maybe next year <laughs> or next month. Who knows? I switched out the cover of the modifier to this yellow one, but the results that I got were too yellow for me. In hindsight, I probably should have reduced or brought down the Kelvin. And I was already tired. Look at me looking like I'm starving. It's probably like 12 or 1 a.m. at this time. <laughs> Anyway, that's it for this shoot. Those are the pictures that I took. I hope you liked what you saw. And if you have any questions about it, about anything that I did in the shoot, in the shoot, you can ask in the comment section. I will be happy to answer. Till next time, see you guys and enjoy the rest of your time on YouTube. Bye for now.